This is the place I was telling you about. Twelve pounds of sugar. Three cans of malt. Twelve cakes of yeast. What did you say? Twelve cakes of yeast. <laughs> When are you going to get that tooth fixed? Every time you speak, you make a funny noise. It sounds like a pipe organ. One dozen packages of hops and three crocs. Now, let's see. See, it goes from seven. Same thing, carry two. Now, for eight dollars and six cents, we can make 15 gallons. But we can't drink 15 gallons. What we can't drink, we can sell. Come on. got you into? Well, you sold that policeman that bottle of beer, didn't you? I didn't know he was a policeman. I thought he was a streetcar conductor. Hey, come over here. What's your name? Stanley Laurel. Say sir when you're addressing me. Now what's your name? Sir Stanley Laurel. He can't help that, sir. It's a loose tooth, sir. Yeah? Well, we'll be seeing to that. What's your name? Oliver. Norval Hardy, sir. Hmm. A couple of beer barons, eh? All right, Shields. Frisk them. Come on. 
minutes ago. Smile. Next. Turn out good. Can I have one? Come on, get out of here. Come on. Hey, you. Fall in. The new men are here, sir. My, my. And still they come. Let us begin with a perfect understanding. I am just as sorry to see you here as you are to be here. Keep one thing in mind. It all depends on you yourselves, just how you're going to fare during your stay here. Never forget that this is a prison. And in a prison, all rules must be obeyed. Discipline is the one thing that must be observed. If you are good prisoners, everything will be okay. If you are not, if you break the rules, then it will be just plain hell on earth. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Since it was his chance, you put him in cell 14. Not in with the tiger, sir. Put them in cell 14. Yes, sir. Get them out of here before I lose my temper. Tiger, you talking to the warden like that. Fine piece of business. Convict talking to the warden. Why, I'll take those men and I'll break them. I'll put them in cell 14. I don't get a hose in there. But I'll do. Amos and Andy. Uh. 
Hello, squirt. Hello. All right, inside. Come on, inside. I said hello, squirt. Hello. I'm sorry, sir, but that was it. You see, shut up. What are you doing there? Keep off of my head. Pardon me, I'm a stranger here. Put her there. <laughs> You're the first guy that ever had the nerve to raspberry the tiger. <laughs> I like a guy that does that.
Good morning, pupils. Good morning, Good morning teacher. teacher. Very good. Now, once more. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. Good morning, dear playmates. Good morning to you. Inasmuch as you are new pupils, I'll excuse that. But I'll have no playing in my class. Now, the first lesson this morning will be, uh... that are here will answer present, and those that are not here will say absent. Now, we shall now have an intelligence test. Who was Columbus? The mayor of Ohio. What did he do? He died. Of course he died. Who killed him? Cock Robin. Who said that? I did. Correct. What is a blizzard? Blizzard? A blizzard is the inside of a buzzard. Hmm. Fresh, huh? How many times do three go into night? Three times. Correct. And two left over. What are you laughing at? There's only one left over. Oh. Listen, you spell needle. N E I D L E. There is no I in needle. Then it's a rotten needle. If I find out who did it, they'll stand in the corner. Uh, now, what is a comet? You. Comet. A comet is a star with a tail on it. Right. Hmm. Name one. 
friend 1010. <gasps> Just for that, you'll stay after school. Now, let me hear what I thought you get. we're going to be in here. Oh, about two months, I guess. Gee, that's a month apiece. A month apiece. Well, you can take it from me. When I get out of here, I'm going back on the farm. Boy, there's a light. I can see it now. Rows and rows of sweet corn swaying in the breezes. Honeybees buzzing in the clover and the smell of new-mown hay in the air. Holly, what? Did you say you can see all that? Why, certainly. That's funny. I, I can't see a thing. It's dark in here. Haven't you got any imagination? Can't you imagine us growing strawberries and raspberries? Oh, I don't like raspberries. Well, we'll grow watermelon. Sun-kissed watermelon. Why, we'll plant acres and acres of watermelon. Why, we'll have more than we can eat. Yeah, and, and what we can't eat, we can sell. Well, just for that, I won't take you with me. <laughs> oh, don't leave me alone. Oh, Sorry, don't leave you guys. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, This looks like our big day. Ah, oh, what's the use? They doubled the guards on the gates. We'll never get through. Well, it's now or never. But don't take a chance now. How are we going to find out? Look. They're opening the gates. See, now's our chance. Oh, wait. wait a minute. Wait a minute. Thanks. I got an idea. I'll find out what's outside of them gates. Hey! Hello, pal. Hey, pal. Hello, pal. Hello, Dean. How are you? Hello, buddy. <laughs> Hello, pal. Come over here. Hello, well, buddy. Well, well, Where have you guys been? We've been down in the hole. Solitary confinement. Yeah? All right. They've made a clean break. They've got those two new fish with them. They have a running star on us. Call out every available man. Scour every inch of ground, north, south, east, and west. Call up every police station within a radius of 50 miles. Get in touch with the sheriff's office and... No matter what news. Well, we captured the tag in the gang. We couldn't get a mile away. We caught him down the old stone quarry and took him in out of shot. But... What? Well, it's those two new fish. They got away. Not a sign of them. Why, they disappeared as if the earth had completely swallowed them. Well, don't worry about those two babes in the woods. Use the bloodhounds. 
Those hounds never fail. Uh, they'll trail them so straight that it'll be a cinch. Those hounds are ferocious. They're killers. <laughs> I'd like to see their faces when they hear those hounds. A hop to it. Yes, sir. Yes, yes. <laughs> recognize us in a hundred years. For once in your life, you've hit up on a good idea. A practical idea? Say, what about the tooth, the buzzer? Oh, I fixed that too. I vulcanized it. You what? I vulcanized it. I put some chewing gum in there and it don't buzz anymore. You're actually using your brain. That's what comes from associating with me. What do you mean, associate? Tut, 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 tut. Tut, 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 tut. Come on here, you always dragging behind. Come here. Now, come on, let's go. Come on here now, let's go. Come on, that's the way. Come on.
I'm going to name this one Oliver. Sing it, boy. I'm going to ride. Going to ride that train. I mean that southbound passenger train. I'm going to buy me a ticket just as long as my own. I'm going to ride that train, babe, all night long. I'm going to ride. Going to ride that train. I mean that southbound passenger train. She's going to choo-choo ride the train. All the boys by Birmingham. I got a letter from a jazz band. I love it, babe. In Birmingham. I got a letter from a jazz band. I love it, babe. In Birmingham. But you dress so neat and she looks so sweet. And when she walks, she'll take you off of your feet. She is a foreigner. Red hot from Birmingham. That southern jack, I mean that great big southern jack. Well, the first thing you do is stick your shovel in your coat. Put your head out the window and watch the driver's roll. That southern jack, I mean that great big southern jack. Thank you. 
This would have to happen just when I'm due back at the prison at noon. Well, I'll see if I can locate the trouble. Do you know anything about an automobile? Yes, ma'am. I wonder if you'd give us a hand. Well, we'd be very glad to. Have you got any tools, lady? Yes, they're under the back seat. Just a minute. Ow! What, what's going on here? Oh, Daddy, I'm so sorry. These two men are going to help us with the car. Oh. All right. Well, I'll keep my head out of the way next time. He doesn't know us. Uh, now, let's see. Uh, the carburetor now. Uh, no, must be the generator. No, it can't. Uh, the spark plug. Now, let's see. Let's see. Oh, good, good, good. Your hands off of it. Get under the car and see if this works. <laughs> I'll do it. Anytime you're up my way, drop in. You can work for me anytime.
look around and see if we know anybody. I was born in Michigan, and I wish and wish again that I was back in the town where I was born. again, and I'd like to fish again in the river that flows beside the fields of waving corn. A lonesome soul am I, and here's a reason why. I want to go back. I want to go back, I want to go back to the farm, far away from harm, with a milk pail on my arm. There's a farm in Michigan, and I'd like to fish again in the river that flows beside the fields of waving corn. A lonesome soul am I, and here's a reason why. I want to go back, I want to go back, I want to go back to the farm, far from harm with a milk pail on my arm. I miss the rooster, the one that used to wake me up at 4 a.m. I think your great big city's very pretty. Nevertheless, I want to be there. I want to see there. A certain someone full of charm, she's charming. That's why I wish again that I was in Michigan, down on the farm, down on the farm. Down on the farm. That's the light. That was fine, boys. It sure was. What did you say? That's a loose tooth that does that. Oh, it is. That should be attended to. Yes, sir. As soon as I get out, I'm going to have it fixed. Do you know that song about the Yanks are coming? Come on. We're going to yank that tooth. Come on. Come on. <laughs> All right, I'll take you now. Come on. Get another customer for you. Fix him up. Okay. Hey, Rosebud. Sit down.
All right, Rosebud. Not him. You. Do you mind if I have my friend in here with me? Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, stop your playing. Which one is it? This one. Hurt? Uh-uh. Then what do you have to pull for? Uh, it's only loose. It buzzes. It buzzes? Yes, sir. Okay, sit down. Up a left molar, doctor. It's a buzzer. Okay. Sit down. I'm scared. Well, there's nothing to be afraid of. Sit down. Who ever heard of a dentist hurting you these days? Why, you won't even feel it. You won't feel it, but how about me? How about those other fellas? <laughs> they were only laughing. You know, there are times when you try my patience. There's nothing to it. It's all in your mind. Now, just sit back and relax. Why, they could pull every tooth in my head, and I wouldn't even feel it. Why didn't you tell him? I thought you were laughing. Say, what are you beeping about? Didn't I get the right tooth? You got the right tooth, but the wrong man. Oh, I beg your pardon. <laughs> steady. Well, get the red right one. See, it didn't hurt a bit, did it? Not a bit. <laughs> oh, we got to get out of here. That's one of the kidneys. Everything is okay. Now, don't get nervous when the time comes. Hey, I ain't nervous. I'll go right now. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Back your dumbbell. You want to kill everything? We got it all worked out. Oh, the tiger's plotting again, is he? How did you find it out? We overheard those two new fish talking it over in the yard. We've got them outside now. Do you want to see them? No, I haven't time to bother with them. Oh, the tiger and his gang are at it again, eh? I have no time to question those two fish now. I'll tell you what you do. Double the guard on the front gate. Put more men on the walls. Throw a guard around the arsenal. Telephone the governor we may need the militia. Train your biggest guns on the front gate. That's where we're going to need the most. So they wanted a showdown, did they? They wanted a fight to a finish, did they? Well, by the living Lucifer, they're going to get it! Now, hop to it. Hey, what's the big idea? We are just in conference. Well, do your conferring down in the mess hall. Fall in. We are 
are not going to the mess hall. We are not going to eat. You're not going to eat? No, we're on a hunger strike. Emphatically. What? You're going to pass up that nice big roast turkey with chestnut dressing and sweet potatoes southern style, great big pan of hot biscuit, and strawberry shortcake smothered in whipped cream, sprinkled with powdered sugar, with a nice big maraschino cherry on the top of it. Of course, followed by uh, a nice big slice of ice cold watermelon and a big black cigar. Any nuts? All you can eat of them. How about postponing the strike till tomorrow? Well, but not one minute after tomorrow. Come on, Foyer! Turkey dinner. Down, you. Haven't we had bad luck enough without you spilling the salt? Make a wish and throw some over your left shoulder. upstairs. You're going to get it. The warden's going to fix you. Huh? And he's set.
showing its appreciation of your bravery. It was the firing of the signal shots in the mess hall that saved us from a disaster of cataclysmic dimension. Thank you, sir. Now go. Begin life anew. Forget this. Let this episode here be just a hiatus to be obliterated from your memory. And don't forget that I'm your friend. Anything that I can do to help you start where you left off, call on me at any time. Thank you, sir. We'll start all over again. We certainly will. Can we take your order for a couple of cases? Why you can get it to it? 